bitch on, we got bulletproof glass now. Bitch, I turned off, I feel like I want a Grammy. I'm speaking Guapanese, I know he can't understand. Hey yo, it's your boy Atomic coming at you with another Fortnite Nintendo Switch video and today we're going to be talking about 60 FPS coming to the Nintendo Switch. We've made a bunch of videos on this in the past but now the odds of this happening have significantly skyrocketed after the recent addition of the brand new performance mode that Fortnite is currently testing on the PC version of the game. So if you guys follow me here into my settings and you look at the left, set, left hand side of the screen, you will see the rendering mode. We've got Direct X11, Direct X12, and the brand new performance mode, which as you guys can see here, performance is an experimental new mode that offers significant performance gains by trading out visual quality to reduce memory usage and lighten the load on CPU and GPU. What have we been talking about in the past? We're gonna hop into creative so I can show you guys exactly how it looks regularly and what it looks like for the performance mode. And you guys are gonna see that this is what we've been talking about, mobile style graphics, worst graphics on the system in order to boost that performance. So have a look at this guys. We are currently on the DirectX 11. Look at how crispy the builds look, the grass. Pay attention to my character. I'm sitting around 500 FPS. We've got the ping at like 20 ping right now as well. So I'm gonna crank a little bit so you guys can see what the builds look like and compare them to when we turn on the performance mode. So now let's take the game into performance mode so you guys can compare and see the difference. So you guys can tell right off the bat here we are sitting in the main menu and my character is super pixelated. It almost looks like I'm trying to play Minecraft here in Fortnite, but that's the whole point for these lower end PCs and these lower end devices. They struggle to even hold a consistent FPS of any sort and the performance is terrible. So obviously in order to increase the performance, they're going to reduce the graphics and you guys are going to be able to tell a lot more once we hop into the creative. So take a look at my FPS. It is significantly higher. It's hitting 700, 800. It's like all the way up there, nearly doubling. I believe we're at like 400 or 500 um, on the other one. And that's on a high end PC, by the way. So on the lower end PCs, you're going to notice that boost a lot more when you have that little, little tiny FPS. But look at the map and how low graphics or low quality the graphics are. You're going to be able to tell a lot more when we start cranking out the builds. But the, the change in performance is actually nuts. I can't even believe that it's hitting FPS that high, but it sort of looks like we're playing mobile, right? mobile on pc so we were saying mobile on switch you know give us those graphics for that performance let's crank it out a little bit so yeah as you guys can tell the bills are extremely like mobile very very mobile like let's have a look at the brick it's sort of the same thing and like immediately you're probably thinking wow that is terrible why would i ever want to play like that we've got to keep in mind when you are on these lower end devices you don't really care how the game looks first of all these lower end devices it already looks terrible you're playing on all the low settings anyways so why not have it look just a little bit worse for that increased boost in fps i think that this can definitely help us out on the nintendo switch let me know what you guys think in the comment section down below i mean they're adding a performance mode this is something that we've talked about for the longest time and they're now finally doing it for the pcs I don't see why it couldn't be added to the Nintendo Switch as well. So hopefully it's good news. Hopefully there are great things to come. But either way, I hope you guys enjoyed today's video and I hope you go on to enjoy the rest of your day.